Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are great. I am Balaji. In this today's short video, we are going to discuss one well-known poet and his uh, one well-known poem. The name of the poet is William Copper and the poem that we are going to discuss is the cast away the cast away is the last poem written by william copper and that too when he was suffering from depression he was completely drowned in the sea of depression and that time he composed this poem the cast away the poem cast away is a tragic one it is about a sailor who is washed overboard and the poet is identifying himself or his situation his condition with that of the sailor who is washed away overboard one of the most popular poets of his time copper changed the direction of 18th century nature poetry by writing of everyday life and scenes of the english countryside in many ways he was one of the forerunners of romantic poetry st colleries called him the best modern poet so from this you can understand the greatness of the poet william copper the cast away is an uh, elegiac poem ballad written by william copper in 1799 the poem is written in rhymed stanzas and gives the account of a crew man who was washed overboard during a storm the poem is based on george anson's voyage around the world after copper read an account which told of one of the men being washed overboard and the horror that uh, his shipmates felt as uh, they watched him without being able to help as shown in the following lines he shouted nor his friends had failed to check the vessel's course but so the furious blast prevailed that pitiless perforce they left their outcast mate behind and scudded still before the wind there is one explicit reference to anson's voice it is as follows no poet wept him but the page no poet wept him but the page of narrative sincere that tells his name his worth his age is wet with anson's tear is wet with anson's tear so from this you can understand 
copper already having dealt with several periods of depression was emotionally struck by this tale which led him to writing the haunting words which would be uh, his last poem published before he died in 1800 I, as i already told you that this is the last poem composed by william copper yes then the cast away is a terrible memorial here in this poem the poet is trying to find a comfort he is likening his situation his condition with that condition of the seller on one level william copper's poem the castaway is about a drowned seller who is swept overboard during a storm and cannot be rescued on a deeper level the poem is about about depression and deals with themes of hopelessness and guilt right through this poem the poet is conveying about himself indirectly it is a metaphor this poem is a kind of metaphor it tells the story of a sailor who falls overboard in the midst of a storm yet this story also illustrates deeper themes in the poem of depression and remorse the poem opens in the first person with the speaker beginning his tale of a man washed off the deck of a ship into the water he goes bereft of hope and friends never to return to his floating home this doomed sailor loves his ship and his captain but but he will never see either again right he is an expert swimmer and courageous but even these things cannot save him his friends try to help but they cannot change the ship's course the wind is too strong they throw to him whatever they think might help but nothing does or nothing helps finally though they are forced to turn away and save themselves from the storm the doomed man continues to live for a while and the speaker reflects on what it must have felt like for him to be deserted by his friends right knowing he is going to die and finally feeling his strength give way eventually he sinks he drowns beneath the waves never to rise again how tragic is the scene right this man the speaker continues has never before been commemorated by a poet but his name and fate are recorded in anson's book the speaker can relate to the man for he to knows what it feels like to be drowning 
he is not drowning in the ocean though he is falling beneath a rougher sea of depression and guilt he is sinking into deeper gulfs but he feels just as hopeless as the abandoned sailor the speaker is perishing alone with no one to help him and nothing to calm the storm of his own emotions the theme of this poem then is the experience of hopelessness in one case there is no hope for a drowning man in a physical sense no one can save him in the other case the speaker's despair is emotional but just as real and just as intense and perhaps just as deadly so in short though this poem is the description of a drowning sailor one hand it is just a description of a drowning sailor in the sea and another hand it is a story it is a self story of the speaker that is the poet the poet is portraying his own sorrowful condition his own helplessness hopelessness through this poem he is identifying himself with the sailor and the sailor's state of mind sailor's condition there is not a much difference between the pain of the sailor and the poet both are sailing by the same boat the sailor is drowning in the water in the real water in the real sea water whereas the speaker that is the poet william copper he is drowning in depression and this much is the difference but the intensity of the pain is the same both are experiencing inscrutable pain right and it is rightly said that wisdom comes from sadness not from smiles right so in this way uh i have tried my level best to tell you the short summary of the poem cast away by william copper for detailed study you can visit to any library and thank you thank you so much have a knowledgeable day ahead thank you see you soon in the next video thank you